area local schools is looking to voters this November, asking them to approve a levy that helps fulfill requirements of the district. 13 Action News reporter Brett and I breaks it all down for us new at 530. A substitute emergency property tax renewal levy will be on the ballot for Genoa area local schools in November. Assistant Superintendent Cody McPherson says this levy was first passed in 2015 and the 5.4 mills substitute emergency levy will be used for necessary requirements of the district, such as utilities, building supplies and maintenance, bus fuel and maintenance, purchase services and personnel. McPherson says it will generate about $1.2 million for the district. He says for everyone $100,000 home, it will cost homeowners $18.50 per month. McPherson says this is not a new tax. This is currently a five-year levy, but the district is requesting for it to be continued. Genoa Area Local Schools is a unique district. We make sure that we're fiscally responsible at all times. Every levy is important for us because our levies don't add more. Our levies sustain what we have. And so why is this levy important for us? Because it's sustaining our current day-to-day -day needs of the district. It is to maintain the excellence that has come to be associated with Genoa Area Local Schools. Assistant Superintendent McPherson says if the levy fails, there will be additional chances to put another issue on the ballot, but could result in cuts if it doesn't pass. There's additional information about the levy on the district's website. You can find that link at 13abc.com. In Genoa, Brenna and I, 13 Action News.